Hello everyone, it's your favorite Asian Charles and today we are here at Lisbon International Airport and doing another lounge review, this time for TAP Air Portugal uh, Star Alliance Go Lounge. With that being said, let's get going and see what we have to offer. Thank you. Avocado. Now for this lounge review, I'm going to start with a shower because I smell like mm -mm. so um, let's have a look what they have to offer okay so there is a small it's fairly small uh, compared to other lounge showers I've been you get a, sh a towel here and on this side you basically is a shower stall with a toilet and this is basically just shampoo and conditioner. There's no like body wash or anything like that. So this shower is pretty basic. It do the job. With that being said, I'm going to get naked into the shower. So just finished my shower. You can see the water pressure up here. It's not really that strong, which is fine. Hot water is not exactly that, that hot. But for me, it's totally fine. I wish they do have some body wash, which that would be nice. Another thing about this uh, lounge is I wish they can also provide some essentials, for example, toothbrush, toothpaste, shaving cream, things like that, which is nice to have uh, before flying out, especially on a long haul flight. Overall, I give this shower six and a half out of ten. Right, after fresh enough, it's time to talk about how you will be seated. So the seating here is actually pretty nice. My preference are always being a restaurant style. So uh, after eating, just get some work done and work. Done. At the same time, there's an outlet in almost every single seat. That's a big one, big one. There's also corner sofas for those of you who want to lay down and take a nap. As well, strollers by the bar for those of you who want to socialize and meet other fellow travelers. So, let's talk about the drinks. I don't know about you, but I love to start my morning with a cup of morning joe. So over here, they have a cappuccino machine that makes you a gazillion type of coffee. <laughs> Caffeinated drinks. They also have tea as well. That goes with the hot drinks. Cold drinks, there's also alcohol and non-alcoholic options. So non-alcoholic options, basically pretty standard. Juices, pop, lemon tea, I think so. As well, there is a bar here you can basically ask the bartenders and uh, basically make you whatever the cocktail you like. And as well, I personally love wine. And there you go. And they have a big selection of wine you can choose from right here. But I think it's still a bit too early. With that being said, let's check out a breakfast. The breakfast buffet include both cold and hot offerings. The cold items include pre-cut and whole fruits, cereal and granola with milk, yogurt, selections of sweet pastries and bread rolls. As well, large selection of deli meat, cheese and boiled eggs. The hot offering are limited, but includes waffles and pancakes with syrups, cooked beans and tomatoes, eggs and sausages. To conclude this lounge review, let's talk about things I really like. First being the shower, and a large selection of seatings, especially the corner sofa which allow you to take a nap. A good variety of cold and hot drinks, as well, cold breakfast offerings. However, it does need improvement in some areas. First, there is no business center, the staff not being particularly friendly. They simply don't smile. 
Body wash should be available, as well the essentials should be included on request, including toothbrush and toothpaste, along with a hair dryer. I also find the water pressure in the shower is slightly low. Greater variety of hot food dishes should be considered, along with snacks such as nuts and popcorns. Therefore, I'm going to give this lounge a rating of 4.1 stars out of 5. But please let me know how is your experience in the comments below. With that being said, I hope you have a pleasant and safe journey. See you next time and thanks for watching.